Hello everyone. In this video, we will see how can we add auto numbering records in ServiceNow. This is primarily used when you have to generate automatic numbers like in the incident table or in the change table for your custom tables or you want to change the numbering of your existing tables. For this, we will create a custom table in ServiceNow. If you don't know how can we create custom tables in ServiceNow, please click on the top right corner and I will go to ServiceNow and I have already created a table called my demo table and under that I have created a field called auto number which is of string type. Now to activate auto numbering in this column, I will go here and scroll down a bit and I will go to advanced view and in this I will scroll down again a little bit and go to default value and click on use dynamic default and click on this reference field now and select get next padded number which is a javascript which will get the next number from the number maintenance i will save this record and now i will go to number maintenance for that i will go to number maintenance and i'll open this in a new tab and here in this table you can see all the existing number maintenance for example you would be able to see the incident one as well here it starts with INC and the number started with 10,000. We will create a similar record for us for the demo table. I will type the table name here as my demo which I created and then I can use any prefix which I want. For example, I can use demo or anything else. And then we can start number with 1000 or any number you wish to. And finally, the number of digits is seven here out of the box. We can change it. So that means the number of digits after demo should be seven. For example, we have started with 1000. It will prefix the zeros before this to make this as count of seven. Now I will save this and we will see in a minute how that happens. I'll go to my demo. And I'll try to create a new record. And we can see here. It started the next number after 1000 and it gave me 1003 and similarly if we go and creating new records it will add number one at the last and we can see the total number of digits after demo which is the prefix r7 so we can change that according to our requirement in the number maintenance as well i hope this video was helpful to you let me know in comments if you have any questions please subscribe to my channel